Gautam Biswas has been spending a lot of time in the dark. Can you teach me? With a girl named Betty. It was uh, very exciting. Their relationship? Strictly instructive. Our goal being in computer science has always been that we would provide supporting tools on, on a computer that help students learn. Please ask me some questions. Betty's Brain is a teachable agent, an interactive software program that turns students into teachers. Bacteria affects oxygen. The program teaches about river ecosystems. But let's try and teach Betty a new concept. Using so a teach I link on the program's interactive map, students introduce Betty to concepts like snails and their relationship with the river environment. Uh, I want to say that snails consume waste, so I say that. As new relationships are introduced, the concept map grows. The student produces a visual map of their own knowledge, a powerful teaching tool. So there's this process of organizing your knowledge, and I think that step brings about a better understanding of the domain. If you want an explanation, click Explain. The students can use resources available in the program to dive deeper into the material and then teach what they learn to Betty. Always popular? The pop quiz. Check out my score on the quiz. I got some quiz questions wrong. What we have created is a system where there is a shared responsibility. The student is responsible for teaching Betty. If they don't teach her well, she, she does not do well. Now, when you're teaching Betty about relationships, you go to Teach Link. Computer science, psychology, and education researchers work together to build a computer program that will sharpen minds, not pencils. You don't realize that you're learning as you learn. I mean, you're teaching Betty something, but you don't really realize the magnitude that you're learning. Learning scientists at Vanderbilt, Stanford, and the University of Washington sparked Betty's brain to life. This has been a learning process for, for all of us. A primary component of that learning process has been to understand the other domain's research. So this is truly what's called an interdisciplinary project. To fine-tune the software, Biswas is previewing Betty's brain at this Vanderbilt summer camp for high school honor students. And when you click that... And do My generation was brought up in learning things visually and problem solving, as I think it will adapt more to my generation. Thanks for questions you have asked me so far. As a teachable agent, Betty's brain has moved to the head of the class. I am a smart girl. It's not just about that they've learned about river ecosystems, but they're prepared or they're preparing themselves to learn for the future.